This one's been planted outside for about 10 days now. There was a couple nights where it got down to about 45. Um, I'd covered this with one of these when that happened. A couple other nights I didn't, and looks like things are okay. There's, um, I'm using seven spray as a complete pest preventative. I don't want to take any chances with bugs ruining my attempt at a giant pumpkin. And I'm also making sure to cut these flowers when they open up. They're just the male flowers, and since this is still such a young plant, I don't want any, any flowers to pop up and hurt bees from using this 7 spray. The vine is already growing, and... It looks like I pointed this thing in the wrong direction. I should have planted this 180 degrees that way. Basically, I should have left it how I planted it. Because after about an hour or so after planting, I decided I did it wrong, pulled it up, turned it around. Looks like that was a mistake because this is headed that way, so I guess we'll start training the vine carefully. This is the hydroponic pumpkin. It's a little further along. And yeah, here's the vine now. It's starting to come out this way. I actually want this plant to go kind of up here. I'm probably gonna hollow out a spot for it to, uh, for the vine to grow up. See, this is why I was using the seven spray, by the way. Something came through, decided to eat some of that after I sprayed. Um, I decided to eat some of this, so I sprayed again. And so far, no issue. This is, this is, this is my 40 gallon container. I mean, already this one's kind of ahead of that one, even though that one had the head start and was being healthier. This one had the small container. Soil's dry, I don't let that get wet at all unless it's raining. Um, so later today I'll probably just take this cup and rotate it. Okay, now I've rotated it. So this vine is going exactly where I want it to. It's going to head this way. I'm going to train it up. So yeah, it's about 10 days outside. Using Master Blend three-part dry fertilizer. Um, I calculated the water in here to be about 30-ish gallons, maybe a little more, so I gave it about 20 gallons worth of food, just as a starter. Before that opens up, I'll clip it too. And of course I have to show you guys the roots, because that would be so rude not to.
I love that. Check in in another week.